Hey, it is Mitchell and today I just wanted to go ahead and do a real quick kind of everyday real world my speed uh, or my type of speed test between my Xiaomi Mi A2 and the Xiaomi Mi Pad 4. My reason for wanting to compare these two devices is as follows. Specs of the Mi Pad 4 the Snapdragon 660 processor paired with either three or four gigs of RAM. The model I specifically have has four gigs. It has a full HD display and it has a 6,000 milliamp hour battery. The Xiaomi Mi A2 has a Snapdragon 660 processor, four gigabytes of RAM, and a 3,010 milliamp hour battery with a full HD display. So, I wanted to see a couple of things. First, am I paying a performance penalty with MIUI? Second, is there hardware optimization in the MIUI ROM that Xiaomi has on the Mi Pad 4 that has not been released or is leaving the, the Snapdragon 660 and the Mi A2 less than fully optimized? I'm gonna shut up. Let's roll the video. Okay, so as you can see, these both are on their stock launchers because the Mi Pad 4 is utilizing uh, Mi UI. We do not have the same type of controls. So to show you things like the speed with multitasking might be a little bit difficult, uh, but let's just show you the speed of opening up apps and holding apps in the background. So we're gonna start with Telegram. And it appeared that the Mi A2 was faster in this case. We're gonna take both of these devices back to home. Let's open up Google Chrome. Okay, identical opening speed for that. Uh, let's go to the same website that I have uh, for this right here. And that is my profile on Steemit. As you can see, actually, uh, Mi UI loaded the page quicker, but it seems as if the Mi A1 did give us uh, a faster time to finish rendering. We'll go ahead, leave both of these apps in the background. So right now we have Telegram in the background. And we can see that both of them reload Telegram virtually at identical speeds. Let's go ahead and open up Instagram. Now there is a little bit of a difference in regards to the application on uh, Instagram on tablet versus phone, but just for comparison's sake, There seems to be a different amount of acceleration uh, in regards to letting off of them. Okay, let's go back home. Now let's go open up Spotify. Okay, very quick search. Okay, we'll go ahead. Dial the background. Start with Chrome. No. Telegram. Okay, virtually the same speed. Okay, next we're gonna go ahead and open up my preferred podcast app, which is Pocket Cast. Tell me what you think is smoother back home. Let's go open up YouTube. Okay. 
So it seems like what we have on the Mi Pad 4 might be a little bit better optimized. And let's go check out the cell phone review I did. Hey, it's Mitchell, and in today's, today's video, video, I'm going, going to do an in-depth photo comparison, comparison between the Shen. Okay, so it seems like the Mi Pad 4 has better utilization of the hardware. Let's go back home. Now speed test. Both of these devices are connected to the same networks. And in that case, in that case we can see that the, the Mi A2 was clearly faster. To their wireless chips, but the Mi A1, or I'm sorry, the Mi A2 finishes it out faster. Now let's see if any of the apps have been dropped. We'll go to Instagram. Virtually identical. And Spotify. Same. I'm, I'm still a little bit rough with these gestures, sorry guys. We'll go ahead, check out Chrome. Okay, pretty much identical loading speed. Okay, now finally I have Okay, so at this point, I had to wait for the videos to sync between across the two devices using Adobe service. Uh, but now that we have them locally on both devices, I have one film look applied over both of them, and we are gonna go ahead and compare their export times. Now before I do that, let's go ahead, check the apps that we have in the background. Okay, everything is still being held. Spotify, Chrome, and this takes us back to Premiere. So I'm gonna go ahead and export these clips for you guys. Go ahead and do full HD. It appears on the video export side, the Mi A2 is going a little faster. While the devices are exporting the video, let's go back home. And let's go browse Instagram a little bit while I wait for this video to export. If you guys aren't following me over on Instagram, it is the same username that I have over here. Instagram, very smooth on both devices. Obviously there is going to be some temperature difference in the screens. 
and the MePad 4, really no stutter at all. Mi A2, likewise, very smooth. Let's check our progress. And we had a failure to export clip. Let's try that again without exiting the app. And here we have the devices coming to a close. And the Mi Pad 4 finished it uh, distinctly faster than the Mi A2. The Mi A2 is just finishing up now. Video saved, done. Uh, the Mi A2, I would say, is definitely a bit warmer than the Mi Pad 4. Uh, this could be because of thermal throttling, but I can't tell you. Let's go ahead and check the apps held in background. Telegram. Pocket Cast. YouTube. Speed test. Spotify. Google Chrome. And I will say that in regards to responsiveness, Going in between apps, the Mi Pad 4 definitely feels a little bit more sluggish actually opening the app. But once you're in the app, responsiveness seems to be identical. Uh, last but not least, I wanted to show you guys an example of the camera response time. We're gonna open up the camera now. Camera response time on both of these devices is nearly identical. We'll use the front firing selfie camera. And camera responsiveness is the same. We'll go ahead, switch to the rear camera. And that's a bit of an unfair comparison because the Mi A2 used the flash. Let's go. And again, guys, these devices virtually identical in camera responsiveness. Okay, I hope you guys enjoyed that video. Uh, if you want to see something else, like, comment, subscribe, share. Peace.